no way back. Has, Meg pissed off as Britons urged Charles to remove them from the line of succession. Harry was born third in line to the throne but is currently in fifth position behind his brother Prince William and children Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. Harry's tell-all memoir Spare was published earlier this month and made a series of allegations against the royal family, so do you think he should lose his place in the line of succession? His controversial memoir has shared insight into the tensions between the Duke of Sussex and the firm and resulted in fresh calls for Harry and his wife Meghan Markle to lose their royal titles. The couple relocated to California after stepping down from their royal duties three years ago, where they are raising their two children, three-year-old Archie and one-year-old Lilibet, who are sixth and seventh in line to the throne respectively. Their decision to leave the firm resulted in Harry losing several of his patronages and honorary military titles but retained his dukedom and position in line to the throne. A new survey conducted by Technapol for the Express between January 25 and 26, some 66% of the 1,624 Britons asked were in support of Harry, and his two children being removed from the line of succession. Just 18% thought they should maintain their place and 16% said they did not know. King Charles III does not have the power to remove a member of his family from the line of succession. An act of parliament must be passed to achieve this. A question being asked with increasing frequency these days, especially after the revelations in Prince Harry's best-selling book, is whether the royal family can and should sue Harry and Meghan Markle. It is not a common occurrence for members of the British royal family to sue someone. However, they do have legal teams in place to protect their interests and reputation, and they have taken legal action in the past when they feel it is necessary. Some notable examples include Prince Charles suing a newspaper for publishing his private journals. It is not known that England's royal family has ever sued a member of their own family. While there have been conflicts and disputes within the royal family, it is not common for these to result in legal action. Strict privacy laws protect the royal family, so it is difficult to know for sure. Harry and Meghan themselves have initiated close to a dozen lawsuits over the past three years. For ardent royal watchers, this is another point of separation between the former and current royal family members. Simply put, England's royal family tends not to sue. The reported position of the royal family is that they have no intention to sue Harry and Meghan for any of their public statements over the past few months or anything written in Harry's new book. The logic is that doing so would only bring more of the kind of attention the couple seems to want. But if the next thing that comes out of the former royal's California camp pushes the royal family and their lawyers over some precipice of tolerance, how would they pursue a claim? Given that Harry and Meghan reside in California and really have no tangible ties at this point to the UK, if a lawsuit were to be initiated against them by members of the royal family, it would almost certainly need to be in a California court. This wouldn't be an impossible thing, but it presents a practical hurdle for the royal family, they would need to be represented by US counsel, as well as an intangible hurdle of not being able to play the game on their chosen home court. Part of the reason it's not a common practice for the royal family to sue someone is that public monies fund the royals. Wasting public money on what could be seen by the public as frivolous lawsuits isn't optically great.
so do you think he should lose his place in the line of succession? His controversial memoir has shared insight into the tensions between the Duke of Sussex and the firm and resulted in fresh calls for Harry and his wife Meghan Markle to lose their royal titles. The couple relocated to California after stepping down from their royal duties three years ago, where they are raising their two children, three-year-old Archie and one-year-old Lilibet, who are sixth and seventh in line to the throne respectively.